Hey y'all, it's Betsy from Happily Ever After Etc. and I am back with another resin tutorial. So today I'm going to be showing you how to make these cute little resin light bulbs. Okay, so I'm a little excited. They are adorable. I saw this mold on Amazon and I knew I just had to have it, but I had no idea what I was gonna do with it. So I bought the mold and then I had the idea that it was going to be part of my spring tablescape. It's going to be the whole centerpiece. I'm not sure what I'll do with them after this. More decor, I'm sure, but still, they are so cute and you guys, they light up. So I'm gonna jump right in. You obviously need resin. I used Amazing Clear Cast for this. You need your light bulb molds. They do come with the little caps and the little um, lights that go inside the caps, but mine didn't come with watch batteries, so you need watch batteries. I also used some little um, hydrangea dried flowers, and I will link to exactly the ones I got because I did not dry them myself. I ordered them, so much easier. If you have them and you want to dry them, it's simple enough, but I don't have any flowers right now, so I just ordered them, <laughs> dried, ready to go. I also used some foiled like confetti pieces. They're iridescent, they're amazing, and some large pink glitter. Then you need your safety equipment, so I'm talking your respirator and your gloves, and a heat gun to pop all those bubbles. We're gonna get started. If you wanna check out the full supply list, it'll be down in the description, including the adorable heart-shaped silicone mixing cup that I've been using lately. Every time I post a video with it, you guys ask where to get it, the link is down below. I ordered another one because I love it so much. Let's get started.
All right, y'all. So once your light bulbs are done, you got a light bulb with the little lip right here. You can see just a little bit on top. So you can actually take your lid. Voila. Put that right on top. And now you can take this and you can just go ahead and you can hang it right on your tree. There you go. Easy peasy. Okay, you guys, are you obsessed? So these are the little light bulbs. I absolutely love them. This one, I've left the top off. It screws on and off. The other, since I'm hanging them, I did go ahead and hot glue on. Now with the little light inside, that's a little bit more of a problem because you can't change out the battery. So I left the lights off of these, but the lights do go on and off. You just can't replace the battery. So either way, I love how they turned out, especially with the light passing through them. You can really see all the glitter, all those iridescent flakes and the flowers. And you guys, this is the straight one. Look at the light bulb one. I love it. And since I'm hanging these, I use some twine. It covers that hot glue. They're beautiful. I love them. I'm gonna do a whole video on how I put the centerpiece together since I decided I needed a little counterbalance for the heaviness of the resin and I used these clear glass bulbs as well. And then of course, I have already posted the full tablescape for my entire spring piece on how I put that table together. So if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell to get the notifications. I try to put up two videos a week, resin, Cricut, home decor, all this stuff. See you next week. Bye y'all.